It's Mel with the Cockeyed Homestead. Did I mention we have a problem with fleas? With all these animals you can imagine. Well, this is how I take care of the problem. First things first, you gotta vacuum. Your vacuum doesn't have to be this nasty, but you have to vacuum. Get everything up off your floor and vacuum your house. And anyone who knows me just knows how much I love to vacuum. Ugh. Next, you have to empty your vacuum, but first, sprinkle some DE in. Yay. Empty it. bring a more D E in. Just a little bit. Never forget. Put the cover on it. And what I do is I turn off the air conditioner, fans, whatever, and there we go. I put some D E in here in a strainer because it'll come out in clumps otherwise. This way you have a nice bit of coverage. Isn't that better? <laughs> yeah, buddy. Whew, and I worried about my house being dusty before. Yike. Next, you have to sweep it in, but this is where the dust mask comes in. So use it. And this is the reason we say to use it. There's this fog of this stuff all over, which means it's going all over your furniture, all over everything. But you can clean that. You can't replace your lungs all the time. Then you just wait for the dust to settle. And wait. I've let this sit for an hour or so. Now I'm going to vacuum them up. <laughs> and I suggest when you vacuum, wear your dust mask. That is how I am ridding my house of fleas. Now, you have to be vigilant, okay, about vacuuming and all that, which I'm not. But this does work. <laughs> it's just really dusty. So after you vacuum, you've got to wait anyway again for the dust to settle because no amount of vacuuming will get out everything in your carpet. I don't care how good your vacuum is. There's still stuff in your carpet. Why I hate carpet. <laughs> and I want to get rid of it. Um, and one day I will. Devin, what are you doing on my counter? Come on, come on, come on. This is our sickly kitty. Not do well. But he's looking better. Believe it or not, hi. He has some energy and he's driving me crazy. Um, but anyway, um, yeah, that's it. So again, I have to wait for the, the dust to settle in my bedroom so that I can, um, yeah, I can hold you. Come on. That's a boy. Um, so I can, yeah, get back in there and clean all my furniture from all the dust. But, look at it this way. My bedroom gets a very good cleaning. Yay! <laughs> so it kind of serves double duty. What are you doing? Well, animals, they're driving me nuts. And so are their little friends. <laughs> this has been Mel with the Cockeyed Homestead. 
Y'all have a blessed day. Hello, weirdo.